The two-day consultation held in Beijing between the most powerful economic officials from China and the United States has sent out positive signals after months of tit-for-tat leverage over trade disputes. The world's two largest economies have reached agreements on some issues and agreed to disagree on others. Both sides agreed to set up a work mechanism to strengthen communication. They agreed that a sound and stable China-US trade relationship is crucial for both sides and that they are committed to resolving relevant economic and trade issues through dialogue and consultation. In a much interconnected world, it is clear that the two economies are strongly complementary and highly codependent. A trade war, should it break out, would be costly for both sides and presents the risk of dragging the world into darkness. According to a report from the US-China Business Council, in 2015, bilateral trade and two-way investment created about 2.6 million jobs in the United States and contributed $216 billion to the U.S. economy, the equivalent of 1.2% of U.S. GDP. Song Guoyou, Deputy Director of Fudan University's Center for American Studies, said the consultation showed both sides are willing to address economic trade issues and narrow their disagreements through dialogue. Li Yong, a trade expert from the China Association of International Trained, warned that in the age of globalization, attempts to resolve frictions by unilateral action and coercion will hurt both American enterprises and global supply chains. Li said that both sides need frank, rational and pragmatic exchanges to seek common ground and put their disagreements aside, maximize their converging interests and be responsible to the people and the world at large. After all, turning back to protectionism runs against historic trends and no one will emerge as a winner in a trade war. The long-term stability of China-US economic trade relations, the ballast stone of bilateral ties, benefits both countries and the rest of the world.